Hi everyone, it's Nisha. So there is nothing better for me than have a shower and smother myself in gorgeous body lotions, body butters and perfume or body sprays that make me feel so cozy or fresh that depends if it's evening or morning so that's what i wanted to talk to you about today how to smell delicious straight out of the shower what i usually do if i buy any perfume i try to get the matching body cream body butter body lotion because that makes your perfume last longer as well and intensifies the smell but i have few here that I specifically use after the shower so some of them I wouldn't wear them to go out for a night out for example these are more cozy going to bed ones and then I have some that I would use in a day when I'm just pottering around you know not doing anything special so let's start with Sol de Janeiro I absolutely love this brand they do the most amazing body creams body butters and perfume sprays for your body and hair they smell so delicious but they also have a lot of great skincare ingredients so they also work for you so my two favorite are bom dia brightening cream and the bam bam one the orange one these two are my favorite so let's start with the bam, bam Bam one. This one has guarana in it, which is which has more caffeine than coffee and stimulates your circulation. Then it has kupukachu butter. It's like shea butter, full of fatty acids and and polyphenols to lock in moisture. Coconut oil, which nourishes, conditions and moisturizes. Acai oil, which is antioxidant, and Brazil nut, which is selenium rich. So you're giving your body all that nourishment while smelling absolutely gorgeous. Oh, I just love it. And the second one, I've written down all the benefits because I can't remember uh, the Bomb Bomb Dia bright cream this one is gorgeous too oh this one is retexturizing and nourishing so this one has alpha hydroxy acids from mango and banana to promote the cell turnover it has willow bark extract which helps with growing hairs so you know if you shave your legs or your bikini line it will help with that and vitamin c star which is antioxidant and brightening and I absolutely love their body sprays and my favorite one is the Cheriosa 62. I also have the uh, Cheriosa 68. This one people say smells a bit like it's not a dupe but it has that similar airy feeling to Baccarat Rouge 540. You could I suppose layer that if you are using Baccarat Rouge but this one doesn't seem to last as long this one on the other hand is gorgeous to be honest I think any one of those if you choose any one of those they are just beautiful so let me tell you about the notes in this one in top that has pistachio and almond in the middle heliotrope and jasmine petals in a base vanilla salted caramel sandalwood and this can be sprayed on hair as well. This is just oh, good enough to eat. Don't eat it, obviously. So the Sol de Janeiro I use mostly in the evenings. It's sweet, it's cozy. It has that, I love anything with vanilla, to be honest. It's just beautiful. So I like to smother myself in that. It, I cannot describe how good this makes me feel. Oh, also, I've noticed that Sol de Janeiro have perfume, which I think is the same as this, what well, has similar notes to this. So I've ordered this, I think it's 10ml um, sample. 
just to try it because obviously this is much more expensive it's actual uh, perfume whereas these are just like body sprays and it's beautiful so I'm happy to have it when I finish that I probably will get a full size if you want that vanilla gorgeous yummy smell I also love the two Kayali ones that I've bought the sweet diamond and pink pepper 25 and Utopia Vanilla Cocoa 21. I love these. When I finish them, I'm definitely buying full size of these. These are my favorite. I have um, actually samples of some others, so I have to go through them. I know people love the Vanilla 28, but I've smelled that. And to me, Vanilla 28 smells more like burnt sugar. To me, this is not vanilla. It's just like really, really sweet sugar so i much prefer prefer this one or this one this one is a bit more spicy the pink pepper and this one to me is very vanillic okay another one that i love to go to bed smothered in but i also don't mind this in a day is the narciso rodriguez pure mask I love mask as well. I've told you before, you must like mask to like this. But th this has some um, floral notes in it as well. And with that, I just buy any of the Narciso Rodriguez um, body lotions. I have this one, the scented body lotion, and I have the Narciso Rodriguez for hair. I think this might be a bit more difficult to get because I am sure that this went with the Narciso in a white cube which is discontinued now but if you just I will try to find it but if you just google Narciso Rodriguez body cream there will be lots of them coming out so this one I think I might have gotten hmm I can't remember if I bought it together with this or I bought this and it came with a little spray of the pure mask can't remember so in here you have in a top mask um, in the middle you have um, different flowers orange blossom jasmine ylang ylang i love ylang ylang and base cashmere and wood this is musky floral powdery um, clean fresh i don't know I absolutely love this. This makes me feel so good. And like I said, I, I will use it at night, but I wouldn't mind using it in the morning after my morning shower either. It's like a clean laundry. It's just the most beautiful smell to me for like a clean girl vibe. Oh, it's just beautiful. Okay, and these two pairs, I would use more in a day because these are not like cozy and sweet these are more fresh airy floral um, spa like scents I would say so the first one is Jo Malone peony and blush suede I have the body cream these are quite expensive I know but I think this has always been my favorite summer, spring summer fragrance from Jo Malone. Um, I've been using the cologne for years. So the, so the body cream has peonies and red apple, jasmine, rose and gillyflower. I don't know what that is. And soft blush suede. So the suede is like a um, soft powdery scent. And this is rich with conditioning oils of jojoba seed and cocoa seed. Oh, and sweet almond. So it smells just like the cologne. It's absolutely beautiful. And then the cologne in top has red apple, in the middle peony, rose, jasmine and carnation, and in base suede. So there is no vanilla in here. Um, this is more of a... Mm. fresh I see myself you know in a flowery flowy dress running across the fields <laughs> I do that a lot <laughs> it's just beautiful and 
you know, some of the Jo Malone's colognes don't last that long because obviously they're colognes, they're not perfume. But this one, I feel it lasts on me really, really good time, especially if I layer it with the body butter. So this is my one of my favorite concoctions on my body. But like I said, I, I wouldn't use that to go to bed. I use that in a day, in the morning. And the last one that I have here for you, Elizabeth Arden White Tea. But this is not the Eau de Toilette, this is the perfume. So the toilette, you will see the bottle goes from white to see-through. So it's a bit ombre. This one is just solid white. So this is Eau de Parfum. And I think they have a, um, it's called water cream that goes with it. But I have the White Tea Pure Indulgence Body Cream. Uh, these are quite inexpensive. You get massive amount in here. I want to try that water cream. This is very, very delicate. This is not gonna be in your face. Um, this is more like a, to me, more like a fresh green tea spa type of um, scent. So let me tell you about the cream. It's lightly scented and that's true. It's not very uh, strong at all. It has very, very light, faint scent. Uh, it has blend of white tea vapors, madras wood, mask with sheer butter. Again, beautiful, moisturizing, lovely cream. And then the Eau de Parfum, it's like a deep, deeper concentration of the Eau de Toilette and it has slightly different notes. So I have smelled the white tea Eau de Toilette, but I never had it. I think the difference is the Eau de Toilette is a bit greener, I think, like marine fresh, a bit like laundry soap. It's not citrusy and it doesn't last as long. This lasts longer. So in here you have in the top clary sage, which you get as well in the um, EDT, Italian mandarin, which you get in EDT, and sea notes. In EDT you also get fern, which will make it smell a bit greener I suppose. And in the middle white tea, mate, jasmine and rose water. You don't get that um, in the EDT, you just get white iris, mate and white tea. And then in the base mask, tonka bean and amberwood, similar to the EDT. So this is like mandarin and white tea with delicate rose and soft mask. This is not as masky as um, Rodriguez. This is much more fresh. I think this one is not as woody as the EDT. It's maybe more feminine, masky, fresh. Like I said, I've smelt it, but I don't remember exactly. I cannot compare it because I don't have the EDT but this definitely lasts a bit longer oh it's beautiful so this is another one that I would use in a day because it's that fresh very calming you know this white tea a bit like I would say sitting in a spa so these are my favorites for straight out the shower goodness uh, like I said the Sol de Janeiro in the evenings or in the summer I don't mind it in a day, but again, it's not like a sophisticated scent that you would go out wearing that. It's more of a fun, yummy, good feel scent. Uh, plus the Kayali, love those. Now, Narciso Rodriguez, I would say, is so versatile. Like I said, I don't mind it at night, in the morning. This is also so good for layering other perfume perfumes with this I just love for everything. Then in the mornings, Jo Malone, Peony and Blush Suede, and Elizabeth Arden White Tea Eau de Parfum with the, I mean, if you get this, I would get the water cream. Um, when I finish that, I might then purchase the water cream. I don't know why I don't have the water cream. I don't know if it's 
something quite new because I haven't looked at it for a long time and I already had this one so um, but yeah when I finish that I will try the water cream maybe it will be a bit um, stronger smelling than this so let me know if you've got those fragrances that you just like to apply after shower when you're going to bed or if you're just running errands for every day uh, so I can try them I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and stay fabulous. Bye.